Jamie, this car is better than yours. Well, no. It just isn't, is it? You're being a... what's the word? We then flashed through the village of Kissing, getting it over with as quickly as possible. Then we went through Petting, and to make sure we reached, um, third base before bedtime, we decided to set our sat-navs. Please name the country. Austria. Please name the city. Foo King. Excuse me. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay. Fucking! <coughs> Sorry. Is your destination Selking? No. Foo King. Kraking has been accepted. Which street should I select? Fucking! <coughs> Sorry. I can't say it. People are listening. Fucking! <coughs> Sorry. Thankfully, Hammond had decided to program his bargain basement system manually. F. It's gone in! And soon, we cross the border into Austria. It's very, very pretty, Austria. No idea why Hitler was in such a bad mood. Eventually, we arrived, um, here. So is this the climax of this stage of our journey? Is it all it's cracked up to be? That's what I want to know. Because often it can be a disappointment the first time you go there. First time I came here, I couldn't find the way in. <laughs> Once we'd arrived in... James was very keen we should get in the back of his Bentley. What's really incongruous about this, I think, is that you're very obviously in a Bentley. All this looks very Bentley. Until you look down here and you see these symbols on this control knob, and it's very obviously a serious off-roader. Oh, what? Those symbols? So you can yeah. set it for swamp, minefield, Christmas or Mexico? Nice. Yes, Hannah. Look. Shall I tell you something interesting about the wood, or one of the woods you can have in this? It only grows on a cliff face in Asia, and the way they get it is they have to abseil down it with their woodworking tools. Why don't they just use wood from a tree that grows in a field? Well, is everything standard in here? No. No? No. So how much is this car? This particular one? Yes. Is 212,000. What? So that means the extras in this car Mm -hmm. cost more than Hammond's entire Jaguar. How much is your Jag? It's about the same. Well, th 50, that Jag 50, with all the extras... That is £51,450. And this has got £142,000 yeah. worth of extras in it. It's just a little bit more on extras than the entire Jag. It's great value. Can I just say, James... Yes, do. I do quite like the interior of this car. Um, no, I do. I'll be honest with you. I like the quilted leather. I like the wood that comes from a cliff and all of that. But the exterior, I'm sorry, it's hideous. Ugly. Big ugly. Um, yeah, well, hang on a minute. Because do you remember, and it is a long time ago, when the Continental GT first came out, mm. we all thought that was hideous. It and was. now we all love it. It's one of the yeah. few things we agree on. Yes, yes, that's true. But I think this is more like you. When I first met you, I thought you were ugly. And now, I still think you're ugly. Hmm. A crushing criticism from one so handsome. James. What? Unlock the doors. James, please unlock the doors. We're in this place. In the back of a car. Together. <laughs> 